monthly challenge just came out, even though it's literally still April, but I mean, I'm not gonna question it. It'll be funny if I complete them before May even starts, so I thought, why not do them now? Still haven't seen the monthly challenges, so... Okay, let's see the monthly ch- Fuck. I gained one extra ticket from somewhere, I don't know where. That's cool. Anyways... Oh. Hey! Drop down the one ticket tier f thing, I guess. I accidentally completed a challenge, let's go! <laughs> let's go! <laughs> let's go, I'm just too cracked. Didn't even need to read them, I'm already done with one. Let's go. Let's go. Pet a cat in the ring, one cat therapy. That's easy. I'll do that as I react to the monthly challenges. Me top hat as a cat mesh. Wait, isn't that like the gif thing? Like, isn't there a gif like that or something? I swear to god there's a gif where it's like a cat doing top hat or something. How do I pet a cat? Okay, nice. Anyways, yeah, I swear to god there's a thing. There's like a funny gif where it's... Richard or Gamma doing top hat? I don't know. I guess it's referencing that meme. BTOIC with slightly faster spinners. Well, that seems like it's just gonna make that one big spinner floor easier. Beat the new monthly tower in zone 2. It's probably gonna suck, let's be honest. Beat the tower with a hat on it. Beat Tofaf with safety nets. Beat any difficult tower in rings 4 to 6. Sure. Beat the OTC after pressing the Pluby button. What's the Pluby button? Well, doesn't matter. Beat any advanced tower in zone 6 to 8. Okay. Beat any tower with a custom OST. Yo, TOI, way, 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 Wes. Wait, never mind. Anyways, beat any intense difficulty tower with one full safety net halfway through. Oh, the, 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 half of those intense towers suck, so that's gonna be fun. Beat any tower made by Nenti. Okay, well, I guess I'm doing uh, no return. BTOV without safety now. Okay, that's gonna suck. Reach the first basement in TONR the perfect run. D by the way, yesterday I was doing TONR perfect run, and I failed on floor 9 because of a lodge. So that's fun. I could have beaten this already, but I guess I was just bad. And beat the new monthly tower in zone 4. Based on the fact that this challenge gives the most amount of monthly tickets this month, I assume that the new monthly tower is gonna suck, so that's gonna be fun. Yep, Tower of Yore for the OST one. Anyways, I'm gonna start out, I'm gonna do something different, and I'm gonna go from easiest to hardest, cause... It's just a lot easier to edit that way, I'm gonna be honest. So, I'm gonna go do Top Hat as a cat mesh, cause... Yeah. show you the gif. It's the funny gif. Look. It's quite simple, really. I hope we get the same size cat mesh, or at least the same cat mesh. That's what I'm hoping for. No way, is it gonna be the exact mesh? Please tell me. No. <laughs> yes! I mean, it's a bit smaller, but it's quite accurate. Well, that's gonna be goofy. What? Oh my goodness gracious. Wait, what happens- what happens if I do this? Let's go- okay, we're doing this invisible now. Invisible mode, let's go. Why did he kill the cat? I don't know, should I bring back the cat? Cause I feel like it's cool if the cat is just simply dead. But if you want me to bring back the cat, I can bring back the cat. Should I bring back the cat? Bring it back. Okay, fine. The cat is back. I'm watching this stream in 144p so I can play Jato. <laughs> what? 144p, that's like a high definition. <laughs> Bro, this looks so weird. I want to play it like this. This looks so goofy. Oh my goodness. How long do you plan on streaming for? I don't know. I want to try to finish before... I don't know. Eight, five hours max if it takes me that long. Hey, Editor Eagle here, and sorry if my voice sounds a bit raspy, I'm currently ill, but at least I can make illegal jokes now, so I guess that's a positive. But anyways, Video Eagle said that it's gonna take him 5 hours. Guess how much time it took him. If you said 7 hours, you'd be correct. This guy said, I'm only gonna have to edit 5 hours, 
and then proceeded to make a, a stream that's seven hours long. Why must he make me suffer? I'm already sick. Come on, can we just go back to the days of old where I, he played Tower of Mind Breaking for one hour? Come on, please. Hopefully it doesn't take me longer than five hours though. Okay. Let's no 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 no! Come on, man! It's like it's like a whole two minutes of progress just lost. Come on! Watching a sea level players get thrown around by the cat challenge has been supreme, <laughs> supremely amusing so far. Here's the difference: I might be an a sea level player, but you should expect me to fail this sort of stuff <laughs> because, like. Pip, you know me. You know how how what fails I have. You know that I'm. You knew. You, you probably should know that I'm gonna fail this sort of thing. The easier the tower is, the the stupider the fails get. I always fail the easiest towers. Like I mean, you shouldn't be surprised that I'm failing these. I thought it was gonna be quite simple, really, but it's not that simple. But it is funny. No, I didn't mess it up. So I guess I didn't mess up. Nope. Nope. I did mess up. Nope. Okay. Also, what's your favorite GD player? My favorite GD player is probably Space UK. He's just so good at the game. I just hope he never gets exposed for hacking. Because if he does, I'll genuinely cry. Hopefully Space UK never gets exposed. Oh my goodness. Why the hell are you a cat? I mean, it's quite simple, really. <laughs> it's so funny to me because if... If people don't know why I'm a cat, then they're just gonna be confused as heck. I am not a furry, no. Don't even start that discussion. I am not a furry. Let's go finally. Please tell me there's a- Yes, there is a message. It's 17 minutes. Oh my goodness. Oh my goodness. 17 minutes. Okay, well... Anyways, DOIC with slightly faster spinners. That's that's the wrong button. That shouldn't be too hard. That's the first spin. Okay, let's see. That that literally makes the tower easier. I'm not gonna lie. What? Sure, I guess. I, I, well, we're going invisible. <laughs> sure. I'm going invisible. There's no wheel because I want to do them in difficulty order because it's way more fun that way, to me at least. The, the monthly challenge is... Uh, uh, TOIC with faster spin. Oh wait! I forgot something. Thank you for reminding me. I forgot something. I haven't used this in quite a while, actually. Let me bring this back. Hey, it's back. Guess who's back? Save. The, the, the thing is... Or, okay, that's not the... Th okay. The things are back. Let's go. Let's go. The things are back. I fully forgot about these. Don't know why I'm why I'm invisible, but... I think it's funny if I beat it whilst being invisible. Why can I no longer... Okay. Oh. Okay. This is so stupid. Why am I doing this? The thing is, I know I'm gonna fall on like floor 9 because of my invisibility. And then I'm gonna be like, what the heck, dude? Why did I fail? That's so stupid. Even though I literally failed because I was just too lazy to click a single button in settings. That's what's gonna happen. I'm calling it. That, yeah. As I said, I should probably just turn off invisible players set to you, because I knew that sort of thing would happen. How does bro know the exact platform to Santa? I'm used to being invisible. I, I did like the one invisible challenge uh, back when I was doing Jato Dares. I hope you get 10 million subscribers. Well, I mean, I doubt I'm gonna get 10 million, but f thanks for the thought. I mean, I'm, I, I upload Jato content, logically f I will not get 10k subs unless I change my content, but at the same time I don't wanna, I don't wanna have, I don't wanna have 10k subs. I'm fine with having like a, a smaller type knit community, cause it's just more fun cause I can easily read the chat without the chat flooding. 
Because let's be honest, whenever you watch like the famous Switch streamers, not a lot of them actually interact with the chat, mainly because it's pretty hard when the chat moves at a 10 km per hour speed. So yeah. So it's kind of fun when, when, when a community is a bit smaller, because I can actually re read out every message. It's just a lot more fun. TOTME is so good. Uh, the thing is, I'm I'm saying it's bad, but I've never played it. The main reason I'm saying it... SPACE UK?! <laughs> Wait, am I, am I a cheater? Because I'm Space UK! Am I a cheater? Oh no! Oh, who's Space UK? <laughs> am I a cheater? Uh... <laughs> no way! The Death Eagle exposed for cheating? No way! Eagle exposed! Space UK! Although I, I must say, you have the wrong color. Uh, I know you're watching the stream, so let me quickly show you what color you should have on, because your t torso color is just... It's way too orange, I'm gonna be honest. Let me get... Let me show you the right skin tone. Let me go to uh, Roblox. Let me go to Display Capture. Uh, to the person, this is the, the skin tone that you should be wearing, because you're wearing the darker one. This is the eagle skin tone, and this is the one you should be using. The one that you're using is too orange, this is the perfect one. It's not too orange, and it's not too yellow, it's it's just perfect. And that's the one you should be using. So yeah. Anyways, yeah, Mr. Space UK, go use that one. I can't believe Eagle would be telling someone that. No! That makes me sound racist, actually, you're right. That, that does make me sound racist. I am- I apologize. I, I- I didn't mean it in that way. I meant it in- in- in a fry type of way. I meant it in a crispy way. Because the fry needs to be crispy, and when it's too yellow, it's too mushy, but if it's too orange, it's too crispy, you know? My orange is the perfect amount of crisp. Also, just saying, Space UK fell. That just shows how Space UK without cheats is- he can't do stuff. TOA sequel because of floor 10. Fair enough. That's what we did get views. 360? Let's go. Let's go. That's another monthly challenge done. And now we're going to the monthly tower. Let's go. That's gonna be fun. Convoluted expanses. T-O-C-E. Wait, isn't there already a T-O-C-E? Wait. I swear to god there's already a TOC. Where is it? Oh! Never mind. I now- Okay, yeah. I remember now. I can guarantee this is the reason why they made it so there's uh, an M at the end of every monthly tower acronym. I- Yep, yep. That's- It's definitely- Oh my god, I already hate how this looks. This tower is probably the reason why there's an M on the acronym, because they just couldn't replace the name. I can guarantee this is, this is the reason as to why they made it so... Uh, monthly towers now have an M at the end of their name. Because the same exact month they did that, a, a tower with an acronym that already is in the game releases, so, you know. Co coincidence? I think not. Surprisingly, there's not too many Zone 8 challenges this month. I was expecting there to be more, but there's only like two. You're saying there's only two monthly challenges in Zone 8, right? You spent three of the seven hours in Zone 8, and you're saying there's not a lot? What? How does that make sense? Are you stupid? Do you know how to read? Do you know how to count? Do you need proper education? Because clearly you do. Anyways, I'm just not gonna bother with this guy. I'm gonna let him edit these videos on his own. Actually, wait, no, I get paid for this. Wait, no, I don't. Where's my paycheck? Whiny Spoiled Brat 28 has sent you a friend request. N ain't no way a Whiny Spoiled Brat just sent me a friend request. <laughs> That's such a stupid name. No! That's such a stupid name, but I love it. No! Yo, I actually did it. Let's go. These light colored elevators will glide you across across gaps in the way they are facing. Always jump from the center of the orange block. 
What? Tell me oh, you mean stand on the block and then jump. Okay. I don't want to die. I need to be careful. Oh, I actually did it. I actually did it. No way. I'm getting better at LHAs. Let's go. Oh my goodness. No way. No way. No way. TOCP. Let's go. Moyai Raid. No. That's not good. Okay, surprisingly, this multi tower isn't too bad. The gameplay kind of flows. I'm not gonna lie, the gameplay does flow. And it's not too long. I'm already on 8. And it's been 12 minutes. That's good for a multi tower. Yeah, I like this multi tower, honestly. It flows. The gameplay ain't too bad. No, it's bad. I hate the gameplay. It's because of that. Okay, luckily that's netted. Luckily. It's like the only red outline part in the entire tower. Can I say a controversial opinion? Sure, sure, go ahead. I mean, I have a lot of them, so... I like Tofaf. Tofaf isn't too bad. Like, I feel like Tofaf is a bit overhated, because it's not that bad of a tower. Like, yeah, it's not good, but it's also not bad. I wouldn't call it bad. It's fun. Surprisingly. Like, it's not the best thing ever, but it's not too bad. Plus, it's kind of fun to rebeat, mainly because it, it's really easy to rebeat, so... For some reason, I really like to Tofo. Fractured Obstacles, to me, is mediocre, but I can see how you would like it. I personally don't really like it too much, but I can definitely see you liking it. It's- Oh, Finna- No, 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 no! 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 The downfall. The downfall. Ah, oh, Man, didn't even save myself at all. Oh, that sucks. Check the chat, you should do the same. What's in the chat? You call this a cancer YouTuber, you should quit. Okay. Guys, I'm gonna quit now. This is the- this is the downfall of the eagle, the rise and the fall. I have risen and now it's time to fall. Because Wani spoiled Brad said I suck, I- I now am quitting. He told me to quit and I must literally quit now. This is the final stream. Say goodbye to the Death Eagle. Because you- you won't be seeing him soon. What did you die to? I fell from 9 to 1. Not 9 to 1, I fell from 10 to 1. On an outside, I didn't die, I just fell due to my own stupidity. Sorry if I can't speak English correctly, I'm trying my best to- to be understandable. No, that's alright. Not- not everyone is- not everyone's first language is English, and that's fine. You gotta start from somewhere, after all. It's not like you're gonna instantly be an English major, you know? You have to start from somewhere. So just keep on speaking, and don't be afraid to make mistakes. And if someone corrects you, then try to take in that information. Try to take in that information. Because it could help you, you know? But yeah, it's fine if you make mistakes. I don't really mind. Because as I said, everyone starts from somewhere. And it's fine to struggle at first. Because at the end of the day, to, to see results, you have to struggle. It's not like you're gonna instantly be the best. When Pat is up there. Thank you, random sign. No way, it's Craig. It's Craig. You steal my job, and now you're gonna steal my Wimpad, huh? I'm not gonna let you see my win pad, no way. Oh, that's a multi-challenge done. GG! We did it. Anyways, beat any tower with a hat on it. What's the easiest tower with a hat on it? Is there no way I could... No, ooh. Ah, oh, yikes. That, if that was a tower rush, I would be crying. You know it's a bad zone when most of the towers are mediocre. If most of the towers were bad, then at least it would be memorable for being bad. But no, it's just now forgettable as that because most of the towers are so boring that they're forgettable. In my opinion, a, a, a forgettable and boring tower is worse than a, than a bad and, remem and memorable tower. I'd rather play a bad tower than a fully forgettable one, because you gain nothing out of it and you, you'll just fall asleep. At least when, when you're bad, when you play a bad tower, 
it gets a reaction out of you. When, when you're playing a boring tower, you just don't feel anything. It's boring. Eagle opinion on jazz. If you're talking about the genre, then I love, I love jazz. If you're talking about the tower, then it used to be my favorite tower, but now Astral Eclipse and No Return to have overtaken that spot. I love those towers so much. Funhouse Frenzy is also really good. I just feel like people overhate it because the gameplay is really good for Funhouse Frenzy. Funhouse, I not I didn't. I meant Never Ending Fun, not Funhouse Frenzy. I meant to say Never Ending Fun. I keep on missing, messing up Funhouse Frenzy and Never Ending Fun. I don't know why. I meant to say uh, uh, Never Ending Fun. Never Ending Fun slaps hard. Craig, that's the wrong way. That's the wrong way. Oh man, that's like f that's a good five minutes of progress just down the drain. I'm just getting bored of Jace and Roblox in general, and that's fair. I mean, you can't play every you can't play a game forever without it getting boring eventually. If you're getting bored, I recommend taking a break. Don't force yourself to play something when you're bored. Cause like I mean, I I started finding Jato boring. Then I started making, like, YouTube videos out of it and streaming it, and it kind of just made me have a lot more fun with uh, Jato. You should ever try finding a way to make Jato more fun for you, or try moving on to something else, and maybe eventually, if you want to go back to Jato, you can easily just come back. No way, new subscriber. Let me see. Thank you, Kind Castle, for subscribing. I appreciate it. I really do. Thank you very much. This Tower of Z Z Z X win is dedicated to you, and only you. I just took a break, and and that did it for me. Yeah, I, I took a lot of breaks from Jato. Like, I... Uh, well, my biggest break was, like, stopping uh, in 2019 and then continuing in 2020. That was probably my biggest break. I mean, because I just forgot about the game. That just shows that I'm not addicted to Jato, because I can forget about the game. Yeah, the challenges are meant to come out in May, but I guess they released them early, because they will... I assume why they released them early. This is my theory. I think Silent Abyss might be releasing, uh, like, this weekend alongside Tower of Oblivion. So, I think they made it so that multi-challenges release now so that they could focus on the releases, the release of those two areas. I could be wrong, but that's my theory. Some of the best last update, last updated, let me see, wait, can't, okay. Last update, 19 days ago, okay, never mind, I guess Silent Abyss isn't releasing anytime soon. No way, it's my factor, you guys! My factor, please friend me, my factor, please, 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 please add me to your friends, this my factor, please, I want to be in your friends, this my factor, please, oh, please, oh, please. Uh, that's so cringe, I feel, I genuinely feel ashamed of saying that. <laughs> Oh, that's another monthly challenge done. My factor 69, please friend me, please, 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 friend me now, or eat cockroaches for an hour straight, please. Anyways, yeah, next is Stofath with safety nets. What? Here it is. Also, cool speedrunning skip for all the new speedrunners out there. Here you go, enjoy. You probably know about that one, though. He's going to die to kill brick damage. Hopefully not. Ring to Tower Rush is gonna be a lot easier now, because you can click the monthly challenge buttons on the Tower Rush. You could literally have... You could literally have Tovaf with safety nets in your Tower Rush. That's so funny. I didn't even think of that. That's actually funny. I just skipped that. Let's go. That's actually funny. What the heck? I like that, I like that. Nice, okay, finally! That's the wrong one. Finally! For so long! Okay, this time I'm not gonna mess this up. I know where to go. The skill eagle, let's go. Oh god. Oh my god, I almost died, just saying. Mango. True. My, my man, my man go was to blow up and act like I don't know nobody. 
Oh, yikes, yikes, yikes. Oh, that's gonna... Oh, that's gonna burn, yikes. Eagle not dying to kill Bricks on a monthly challenge, challenge. Bruh. Welcome to the Eagle stream, where Eagle is being bad. Indeed he is. Yeah, we had no info about Mount Rat. It sucks that it got delayed, but at the same time, the reasons are fair. Not delayed, it sucks that it got cancelled. Hopefully it gets revisited, I, although I doubt it, I hope it does. Also, that kind of just proves that Mount Trad was literally meant to release, like, June 21st or 19th, back in 2021 or 2020, I forgot. But it was meant to release a while ago, and that's funny to me. Oh wait, I'm gonna die! Bruh! Eagle, why do you hate Moyai? Uh, well, uh, I'll explain the backstory. Basically, uh, if you don't know, there's this one YouTuber called Adamir, and he hosted this Easter event one time, where, where we basically made an Easter steeple, and uh, I was one of the builders for it, and basically, I wanted to, like, add some stupid goofy lore to it, so I decided to make lore about how I hate Moya emojis, but I love skull emojis. And from there, I kind of like just started doing that regularly, and it basically started from there. That's the backstory of my hatred for the Moya emoji. Insert 2017 gaming music. No, oh, what the heck? That was zero HP. That was literally zero HP. What the heck? What the heck? I don't mind it that I'm- I don't mind that I'm alive, but what the heck? What challenges though is- you can see- it, you can see this challenge right up here. Where is it? Let me find it. This. You see the thing I'm moving around now? This is the thing. You can see the thing. Oh wait. That was not intentional. Don't even know how that happened. But sure. Oh, I'll just... Why did the crystal not work? Why did the crystal not work? Are you kidding me? Uh, I'm just too good at the game, what can I say? Yeah, I'm getting better at the section, which is... Jinxed it. Okay, this time I'm not gonna die. Let me heal to f flip it. Pop in the crystal. Pop in a crystal for all my for all my ladies and gentlemen. Okay. This one's actually easy to avoid now. No, I pretty much beat the tower. There's no way I die now. Literally no way I die I die now. Oh don't kill me. No, 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 please don't kill me. Don't kill me, don't kill me, please don't kill me, please let me live, please let me live, please let me live. <laughs> Bro, BTOER, but can't be Tofaf with a nerf, okay, thank you. Thank you for giving me the motivation to continue. Oh my god, the United Kingdom, is that a Geometry Dash Space UK reference? Oh no, oh no, no, not here, not now, please, 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 not now, not here, please. Anything but this, please, not here, please. Oh, I lived, I lived, I live, I live. Ah, I live. Oh, thank goodness. Yes, they did finally add the multi-challenges. Oh, that was such a close one. Oh my goodness. And the fact that it was at the end as well. 360. Let's go, we did it. And it only took half an hour. Oh, what's next? Okay, while I'm here, someone uh, give me an easy... Give, tell me what's the best uh, uh, thing for this monthly challenge. I don't remember anything about the star, but I'm gonna trust you that it's short. Hopefully, it is. So I could do it quickly. I still don't remember what this tower is, and I'm, I don't know. This is one of those forgettable towers that I don't remember at all, isn't it? 
I personally just despise Toadette's gameplay, and the Dark Floor of Toadette sucks even more. Like, it's fine if you like it, because I know there's people who like it, but there's also people who hate it. Toadette is the type of tower where you ever love it or you hate it, and I'm a person who absolutely despises it. But it's fine if you like it, though. Because at the end of the day, everyone's gonna have different opinions, so... No, pun in no, no point in finding over them. Let's go, subscriber! I'm on a time section, though! Wait, I'm on a time section! I can't check! No! No, wait, I'm, I'm gonna go back on the stream, wait, who was it? Who was it? Who was that subscriber? Let's see who subscribed. Let's see. Thank you, Hugo Gamer, for subscribing, I really appreciate it. Thank you very much, Hugo Gamer. Thank you very much. Sorry that I couldn't say thank you at first. But I was on a time section, but still thank you, Hugo. I appreciate it. You, you almost have 666 subs. Well, do I? Let me let me check. Let me check. Oh, I almost do have 60, 666 subs. I'm about to turn into the devil. N ain't no way. I'm about to turn into the devil. Yo, someone subscribed again. Oh, it's Nan. Well, hello, Nan. Well, thank you for resubscribing, I guess. I appreciate it. I think. Not I think, I, I do. Thank you, Nan, for resubscribing. Thank you very much. Yo, it's the song. No! I didn't realize that. Oh, no. I missed me myself hitting 666 subs. I'm at 667 now. No! I couldn't turn into the devil, I missed it! I missed my chance to turn into the devil! Well, goddamn! Oh, crud. Oh, okay. Hit the button. He climbs up. Okay, let me, let me turn into the devil, please. I just wanna turn into the devil, the devil eagle, devil eagle. Yes! Six, 666. Finally! I can unleash my true power! Unsub, guys. That's- no, please don't unsub. <laughs> the downfall of the Death Eagle starts with people unsubbing. The Devil Eagle is real. He's the new canonical version of the Death Eagle. Let's go. Welcome to the, the Eagle channel, where we fail in ways that nobody ever has. Wow! Whoa! Oh my god, finally floor 9. Oh, wow. <laughs> finally someone subscribed. Let me see. Thank you, Kirby. Lots of place for subscribing. Let's go, it's a fellow Kirby enjoyer. Let's go. That's a big W right there. Uh, well, at least at least I get some sort of happiness in these in these very troubling times. Also, the people wondering why the zone 2 monthly tower is in zone 2, even though it feels like it should be in, in zone 5. It's because it's it's an intermediate challenge. And because of that, it has to be in an earlier area. If an intermediate challenge is in zone 8, then it's not really an intermediate challenge, is it now? So I feel like it's fine that it's in zone 2. I mean, I, I, I'm only a, a Kerbo because I couldn't find a better profile picture, so I just looked up Discord profile pictures and I saw Kerbo and I was like, Oh, that looks cool. And I'll, I'll use that. And that's pretty much the backstory of how I got my profile picture. Yes, let's go, we're just success. And that's all four in intermediate challenges completed. Let's go. Now it's time for advanced challenges and it's, okay. This is the one that I've been waiting for because I have no idea on what this is. Let me change the name. I want to know what the Pluby button is. No, that was bad. That was not a good 360. Nope. Pluby mode. <laughs> what? Okay. I'm, I'm gonna be trying to see if it can hit the corner. Come on, Pluby, hit the corner. Tell me if I miss Pluby hitting the corner. Let's, let's try to make Pluby hit the corner. We gotta make it hit the corner. Ah, oh, that was close, that was close.
N next monthly challenge, they need to add a Subway Surfers mode where it plays Subway Surfers at the bottom. That's what we really need. That's gonna help our attention spans when playing the towers. I can already tell I'm gonna get distracted when editing this. And I will start looking at the Pluby and stop editing for a bit. That's definitely gonna happen. Like, I'm calling it. No, don't speed up. No, Pluby, stop. Pluby, stop it. No, you're going way too fast, Pluby. Slow down. You need to slow down, Pluby. Pluby, slow down. Oh, it's slow down. Why is it going so fast? Pluby, you need to chill out. Pluby. Chill out. You're going way too fast. Why are you going so fast? Chill out. Please, chill out. Why are you going so, so fast? Do you want to get fed or something? Why are you going so fast, Pluby? Please. Please, chill, please. Watch your jet, bro. Watch your jet. Top commentary. Yep, this is the top comment. This is... The, the commentary and the eagle channel. Oh, don't tell me it speeds up as the farther you go. Does it speed up the farther you go? If so, that's so evil. That's so evil if it does. Don't tell me it speeds up. It does? Oh my goodness. Oh, well, I guess Blueby just hates me. Oh, yep, it's going really fast. Come on, Blueby. Please slow down. Blueby, please. Slow down, Blueby. Blueby, please. Please, Blueby. You don't gotta go so fast. Don't call her Poopy. She's the Blueby. How dare you? That's really rude of you. I cannot believe it. I honestly cannot believe you, you could say such a thing. I am very disappointed in you. Blueby, don't go faster, Blueby. Blueby, stop it. Stop it, Blueby, Blueby. I can guarantee, because I'm talking about Pluby so much, my YouTube recommendations are gonna be filled with Pluby. They're listening to us. Nah, I'm joking. This is the evil Pluby. No, no, no. I almost died. That would have been not. That would have been bad. I think your chat is in love with Pluby. Well, I mean, to be fair, Pluby is pretty cool. Almost pulled a toe off. Yep. Almost dead, sadly. Almost dead. Make a Pluby counter. Why would I make a Pluby counter? It's just... Pluby. And if you're talking about counting every Pluby... Every time I say Pluby, then I don't want to do that. Because... Because... Not only would that take a lot of time... I don't want to... I don't want to... I, I would not want to edit that. It would just suck. I don't know many times people said Pluby. I said it way too many times, like 128 times probably. Pluby, 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 Pluby. I've said Pluby so many times that the word Pluby has lost all of its meaning. What is a Pluby, and what does it mean? Find out in the next episode of Total Drama Island. Hopefully, I was about to say hopefully I don't mess up on the final stretch, but I've grown to focus both on the tower and the plume. That's what I've grown to do. And honestly, it's been working. I can now look at both at the same time without getting distracted. Yeah, I've seen the new Total Drama Island season. The characters are amazing. I love that season, unironically. The season is really good. You're not gonna trick me, Plume. You're not gonna trick me at all. I don't care if you hit a corner. No, I don't care. You're not gonna. You're not not gonna beat me, Pluby. I'm too good for you, Pluby. Yeah, that's what I thought. Slow down. Slow down. Slow your horses, Pluby. That's what you need to do, Pluby. Come on. Yeah, exactly. Now go away. Oh, never mind. It's still here. We did it. Pluby has been vanquished. So, the next monthly challenge that I'm gonna do is gonna be a 2 for 2. Goodbye, Pluby, I'll miss you. At the same time, I will not miss you. It's not Tower of Yore because there's something better that, than Tower of Yore. You see, there's this area called uh, Zone 8. It was recently added to the game. And it has this specific tower, which is pretty goofy. I'm not gonna admit, it's pretty goofy. The tower is called 1-9. Those 
this Tifer tune slaps, by the way. I don't know why, but I love it. It's pretty cool. It reminds me of like the gar the revamp realm garbage area OST from Find the Chomix. Probably because it's made by the same composer. Hey, Editor Eagle here. And today, I will be reviewing the Jatov Towers from Zone 8. The best tower is easily TOBK. The worst tower is easily TOBK. The most mediocre tower is easily TOBK. The best tower is easily TOBK. The most time consuming tower is easily TOBK. The most TOBK tower is easily the Tower of Zany Architecture. The editor eagle sections are very fun to make. It's also fun to make because, like, I do a specific tone of voice. So, I like my regular voice. Because now Editor Eagle is a whole different character. Like, Video Eagle, in a way, Video Eagle is just the regular old me. But Editor Eagle is like a full on different character. He's like pre recorded in that. You, you ain't never seen Ed Editor Eagle live because he doesn't exist live. That's the Eagle lore. And the Eagle lore is stupid and convoluted. Just like the FNAF lore. Oh, I'm dead. Never mind. I'm alive. Let's go. Safety net. What's the worst tower you've ever played? Tower of Zany Architecture. Easily. Tower of Zany Architecture is pretty much the new TOBK. Except I, I never really hated TOBK, but I actually dislike the Toza. Like, I, I always said I hate TOBK, because when I first saw TOBK, I just hated it. And I was like, eh, why not? I'll just say I always hate it, so I have an excuse not to play it. But then I kind of enjoyed grinding it, so, you know. Can't really pretend to hate something you don't really hate. That's why I did the TOBK review. Not only because, like, it's a funny April Fool's joke just to make a review about a tower that I keep on ranting about. It's also f just fun as heck. The April Fool section was also pretty fun. Sad that most people won't end up seeing it because, well, it's in a whole different folder. Because I decided to remove it because I made the thing only for the premiere. Because I felt it worked like that the best. And it wouldn't really have worked that too well if it was in a video. Because uh, when it came to the premiere, you, you can't see the timestamps on the premieres. So whenever I said the video's over, it, I mean, it might have been over and you, did, you couldn't have known. I removed it because it's not really fit for the video. It fits better for, like, a premiere. I made it knowing I, I'll do it for the premiere, and once the premiere was over, there was no point in making it. I mean, why would there be a point? Because, like, when you know that there's an actual video, when you know there's, act like, an actual timestamp for it, then you kind of know that it's just gonna start. But from for the premiere... Like, you might have expected it to just be that uh, uh, eggle thing, and then it's over. I haven't done a voice reveal. Don't know if it's good or not. Hi guys, the Death Eagle here. This is my voice. What is up, gamers? The Death Eagle here. Welcome to another Minecraft Let's Play. And today, we'll be playing Jato in Minecraft. Hello, guys. This is my real voice. This whole time, it was uh, voice stranger. This is my real voice. GG, we beat it totally... Oh my god, no, there's a final strat. <gasps> no. This song slaps, dude. Beat it. The ones were truly nine for 6A. That was French. Let me see. Did both count? Yes, both counted. Let's go. That's two done now. Let's go. Well, three done, actually. And next is beat any intense difficulty tower with one full safety net halfway through. Yeah, as I said, I'm not gonna be leaving zone 8 for quite a bit because a lot of the challenges are in zone 8, surprisingly. At first I was like, no, there's not many. But nope, there's a lot. There's a there's quite a lot. So yeah. The thing is, I could have done, I could have done either two, two or T O M L, and both of the, both of these would have counted for this challenge. So in a way, no matter what you do, if you do T O M L or T two, you're gonna beat this challenge. 
So in a way, beating Tio Amel is also a, a two and one. This time, though, uh, hopefully the music zones don't break. So I actually get to experience the music. Tio Amel kind of grew on me. First, I was like, mm, it's mediocre, but I kind of like it. Like, I love the first half atm first half's atmosphere. The main thing that grew on me was the first half. Like, the second half I liked it, not because... Be well, I liked it because I didn't hear the music. But I mainly liked it because it was just, like... The idea of it is was so cool, but... The first half has started to grow on me, and it's actually kind of fun. Do a cracked voice. Hey, guys! Who can I sell here? Welcome to another video of Jato Flood. And today, we'll be talking about the Flood... The, the, the Flood... I can't speak. And today, we'll be talking about the monthly challenges flawed and wow, how they can be fixed. So, solution one, remove them. Solution two, Jato devs, listen to me and remove them. Oh my goodness. Solution four, what backwards? <laughs> oh no, I'm so stupid. Let me show you a little skip. Let me show you a little skip peru because it's funny. If it works. Yeah, yeah, it's like that. Just do that. Oh my god. Yeah, see? Th that's such a cool skip. Literally lets you skip the like the beginning. It's so funny. That's why you never do a Logan ISL impression. If you do a Logan ISL impression, you're gonna fall. I'm gonna fall all the way down to floor one. Surprisingly, this is only the second time that I fell from like, from to, all the way down to floor one. Surprisingly, for Eagle standards, this stream has been going well. For regular people standards, this stream ha has been going terribly, like very terribly. But for my standards, it's gone. It's that's it's gone pretty well. After seeing how February was and March, I mean, I don't mind. Only having two fails. Guess what happened one minute ago? Well, what happened? Because I, I probably won't guess, as there are so many guesses I can make, and I can guarantee that I will not guess correctly, as there are infinite possibilities of what the answer could be and what the answer could not be. Anyways, what's the answer? I fell. Oh my crap. <laughs> Yeah. Hopefully you get back to micromanagement soon and you beat it. It's like that you failed on the final jump. I don't even know what happened. But whatever it is, it's funny as heck. And that's definitely gonna be a clip that will be put into the video because it's a funny clip. Unless I accidentally skip over it, which hopefully does not happen. And if it does, I will be very sad. Hey guys. Commentary Eagle here, and today I will be commentating on TOML. TOML is a pretty fun tower, and I like it. I like the first half's atmosphere, and I like the second half's wildness. TOML is in fact the tower that was bad at first, but then it grew on me. This has been Commentary Eagle, and I hope you enjoyed the commentary. Oh my goodness! That came in close! Save of the century right there, my buddy, old oh, pal. Save of the century. Sorry for swearing. I mean, you can swear if you want to. I don't care whenever I swear. I just myself choose to not swear. It's because, like, I don't really like swearing. But you can swear, it's fine. Like, that's why I don't cut out swear words in my videos. Is because I don't care whenever people swear. I just personally myself don't swear. I don't consider myself to be family friendly because I could sometimes make dirty jokes and because when I VC with people I'm not gonna ask them to not swear because I don't care. Like if a person wants to swear they can swear. In my opinion whether you want to swear or not is up fully up to you. Like yeah sometimes you just shouldn't swear in certain situations but most of the time like it's fully up to you whoever you want to swear. And I personally choose not to swear just because like I don't like to. But yeah, that's like the reason why I don't really cut out the swear words in my videos. Mainly because I literally can't, don't care if pe other people swear. 
Because, I mean, I used to swear a lot. I was a potty mouth back in the day. If you looked in the Jato server messages, like, you could see me swearing. And you could see some cringe, cringe messages as well. Because I was a very cringe kid back then. But it's okay, people change. I've never done the second half with the actual music, so hopefully it's not too bad. I wanna die already. I can tolerate this for, like, for one, like, minute. After a minute, it starts getting annoying. And, <laughs> and yeah, like, it's tolerable at first, but then it just gets so annoying. No, don't loop! Don't loop. <laughs> uh, turn off music, I can't. It's my fault, I didn't press the button. I should have pressed it. Should have pressed it. Uh, <laughs> why? Why did I not push the button? This is my fault. This is my fault. This is my fault. This is. So, guys, how's your day been? How's your day been? Please, I just want to. It's much better without the music. Life is finally going back. My life is finally fixing itself. I need better me. I need music, though. I can't just play without any music. I know, I know the best song. I know what the best song is. If you know Astral Eclipse, then you know what the song is gonna be. Let me quickly... Okay. We're on the final stretch now, boys. This is the final stretch. We're beating this. Come on, let's go. Final stretch. Let's go! Oh my god, dude. The best song in any- Yeah, this is probably my favorite song in any tower. My old favorite song used to be the Ast- Not Astral Cups, Triple A Final Stretch song. Now it's this, like, this song slaps unironically. Like, Astral Eclipse is just good, because you know that if you get past it, this is what's gonna be waiting for you. This song is gonna be there, waiting for you. And it slaps. What? Okay. But yeah, the reason why Astral Eclipse just is so good is because this song is waiting for you at the end. And it's so satisfying. Yeah, songs of vocal should be, like, more common. Not overused, but more common. Like, for example, this song, it adds so much to the final stretch, because it fits so well. Yep, I'm still alive, hello, Yashgabe. I feel like Astral Eclipse has better music than TOTDA. Like, this just carries so hard, unironically. Just saying, ever since, ever since I started playing good music, I've not failed. I literally have not failed. Like, just saying, coincidence. <laughs> yep, it's a coincidence. It's fully a coincidence. Yep, yep, it's it's a coincidence. Mm -hmm. We've done it. Goodbye, Persona 5. We have done it. We have beaten. Oh, uh, what's the multi challenge called? This one, this one right here. Next is gonna be this one right here. Total sum. Yeah. It sucks so much that if if I get to the final stretch and I do that, not the final stretch, but if I get to the tower rush and I do that, that's gonna suck. What? Floor 2 seems so beginner friendly for a rem, and I don't know why. I mean, it's a good introduction floor to be fair. I kind of like what's beginner friendly because it introduces you to everything and, and I like it. I don't know if Hesden is Ring 4 Subrealm or Ring 5 Subrealm. Hesden is actually both. Hesden is gonna be for... Uh, Hesden is for Lost River and uh, Sound Abyss. Which, um, I don't know how that's gonna work. But however it works, then... I, I hope it works well, because, I mean... One Guardian for two Subrealms... I don't know. I don't know how they'll pull it off. If they do, good for them, but... How are you gonna make it so... I don't know, unless they're gonna make like two palaces or something. If, if they mess up the obelisk, that's actually gonna be catastrophic. Mainly because if you mess up the very final thing, the very climax of everything, then it's just not gonna be good. Like, I don't know.
Like, they genuinely just simply cannot mess up the obelisk. Also, I wonder how palaces... I wonder whether palaces will have, like, their own palace feel to them. You know how citadels have a citadel feel to them? I wonder whether palaces will have, like, their own, like, palace feel to them. Have you ever tried... Tr have you ever tried to create a tower? I have, and I failed miserably. Floor 6 is really good. Floor 6 is probably my favorite my favorite floor, mainly because of like the whole force field thing. It reminds me of Adventure Forward 2 a lot, and I don't know why, especially the fireworks. It reminds me of that like, uh, Dragon City. I forgot which one it was, it was like that one Dragon City or whatever. The one that was like, I don't know, it's just a Dragon City. It reminded me of like the Chinese New Year's or whatever. Like it was probably one of my, one of the most memorable worlds in my opinion. It's really cool. It reminds me of that a lot, I don't know why. And it's so sick, I love it. Nice. The one Dragon City, yes. I love the shooting mechanic so much, it's so sick. It's actually really cool, I love it a lot. Like, Totasm just slaps so hard. And it's so surprising to me how Tosaps is like the prequel to it. What the heck? Like how did ha how did that happen? I do you remember what Tosaps is since I don't. I don't remember what Tosaps is. I all I remember is I is me not enjoying it. I just remember that it was like Tower of uh, what's it called? It just felt a lot like cone mesh climbing. It's just like a safety net tower that basically has some stupid spike spiky gameplay as in like the gameplay spikes a lot didn't even see nice remember when you forgot about totst uh, but then you were doing it it reminds me of that of the disconnection i still don't remember what totst is wait what i don't what what is totst can you actually remind me oh two sides oh yeah that one okay yeah, i can then see why i forgot about that one it's such a forgettable and mediocre tower. Like, those are the type of towers that belong in Forgotten Ridge. The ones that are literally forgotten. Nah, no, but you know what tower is forgettable? When I still don't remember it, even after, like... E when I don't remember it, even after a week. Like, just a week. Like... Forgotten Ridge is good. No, I'm not saying Forgotten Ridge is bad. I'm just saying... No... I'm just saying that it belongs in Forgotten Ridge because uh, of the name. I like Forgotten Ridge, it's like my second favorite sub -realm. I'm I was just uh, doing a joke of the name since the name is literally Forgotten Ridge. Uh, do you plan uh, on doing every tower rush or is there one you'd never do? I'm planning on doing every tower rush except of Pit of Misery because Pit of Misery is... <laughs> that scared me. Because Pit of Misery is impossible. So why would I bother doing something that's impossible? What's that? What is this warb? Huh? The heck? Okay, well that's a bit goofy. Uh, the one tower that I'm most scared about is zone 1. Mainly because it's the, probably like one of the hardest tower rushes, mainly because of cop. And because it, it just has in, an, an infinite amount of rems. So that's fun. I hate POM. I don't hate POM, personally. I feel like it's a cool idea. I just wish it was... <sighs> I just wish it was, like, executed, but not better. I don't know. I just w wish it was... I, I don't know how to say it. It could have been basically just executed better. I feel like... It's well, wacky. Do you like Zest Plus? I'm gonna be honest. I've only played Zest Plus once for a monthly challenge, and then I never played it again. So I'm, I don't know if I like Zest Plus. When will you grind Todai? It's really short. I'm planning on doing Todai as my first cat, actually, because of how short it is. And since it's short, it's kind of... It's probably going to be really hard, but it's also going to be really short. Meaning that failing won't set you back as much. Or for example, uh, TOGF. Failing TOGF, it sets you back a lot because of how long the tower is, but failing Todai, when you fail, you don't really lose too much time, mainly because, well, it's not that long of a tower. So, 
So yeah. So I might do Todai as my next Soul Crushing. Not Soul Crushing, but uh, Kata. Not next Kata, first Kata. Next Kata. I'm saying that as if I've beaten the Kata. <laughs> Oh, oh! My... Bro... Bro... Oh my goodness... I was one second away from death... Oh my... Goodness... The heck? I mean, I don't, I don't mind, but... That was a near-death experience! <laughs> wow! 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 I wasn't even holding my key on F. Which is the worst part, because because I, I could have easily died. Oh my goodness. Have you ever hit it in events? Uh... There was this one full Ragnarok event in a game. Like, I'm talking about Roblox events back when they were good. And I hated that event because I sucked at it. <laughs> it took me like five hours to get one hat. What's your favorite event in Jato? Hard, hard, hard question. Because I love both Halloween 2022 and 2020. I might say Halloween 2020 just because of nostalgia. Like, Halloween 2020 is why I'm playing Jato right now. I'm literally playing the game because Halloween 2020 was recommended to me. So I kind of have to say Halloween 2020, because, like, without without Halloween 2020, I wouldn't be playing Jato right now, you know? So I kind of have to say Halloween 2020. Well, I maybe would have been playing Jato, but maybe not at the same level. And the crown goes mild. What tower did you do for a tower with a hat? I did tower of, uh, T-O-X, I did T-O-X, Xanthophobia, or whatever it's called. I got- I couldn't beat C-O-H-P. In the Halloween 2020. So, and I, cause like my skill level wasn't there yet. And I'm so happy that I didn't force myself to do it, cause I wouldn't have enjoyed it. I'm so happy I, I f stopped. And to this day, COHP took me two hours, two years to beat, on and off. And to this day, it's my proudest achievement in JTO. Because it took me so long, and the victory was just so satisfying. I'm so happy that I actually, like, beat it. Even if it took me, like, two years of on and off grinding. I'm still proud of it. Yikes. I forgot I need to I forgot it's safe on like on orbs, not in the air. Fully misread that. My fault, sorry. At first I was planning on making a separate video for cope, like a cope experience, but then I realized, eh, I'll just put it into the put it into the Sonic experience. And then I realized that there there's 30 minutes of cope footage that well not cope, but there's gonna be 30 minutes of cope. My plans for the Zonate experience at first were literally to just do everything up to intense. But then I changed my mind when I when I wanted to play everything. And I'm happy I did. I really am. Did I spell challenges wrong? Oh my goodness, how did I not notice that? How did I... How did- why did nobody ever tell me? Why did nobody ever tell me? The heck? Was it only- was it- oh. Did anyone else notice that? How- how did I not notice? How did nobody tell me? Why did nobody tell me? Why did I not notice? Why did I even make that in the first place? How am I that stupid? Are all four of them as well? What? Oh my goodness. Didn't even realize that. That's actually funny. Well, that's going into the iceberg. Challenges misspelled like a- Am I lagging? Well, YouTube, you're making my stream go down now. Let's go. YouTube, stop buffering. Stream. Tell me when, when it's back to normal, by the way, because I assume it's just YouTube doing this again. Because it happened last time on the Zone 8 stream. 
And then the footage cut. Just saying, it also... Bruh. Just saying, it also happened on Totasm, I'm pretty sure. Like, last time I lagged on the stream. Like, last time the stream went down... Uh, is, this, is the stream actually dead? Am I talking to no one? Am I schizophrenic? Hello? Uh, please tell me it's okay. Please tell me it's okay, stream. Please don't go down. Last time you went down on Totasm as well, why are you doing this again? You just don't want people to experience Totasm. Yes! Okay, I'm back. Yeah, it was a YouTube issue, thank goodness. It's the, it's the second time this has happened. Come on, man. Oh, crud. Yeah, it's Totasm is cursed. Yeah. Don't tell me it's lagging again. Why? Are you kidding me, YouTube? I don't know. I'm like, my internet connection is fine, I'm pretty sure. I don't know what. Is it on my end on YouTube or YouTube's end? I'm so confused. Totasm, stop cursing the stream! If. <laughs> Totasm! Please! You're such a good tower, just don't curse the stream, please. I'm about to die. You're gonna miss my death because of the stream. The <gasps> oh my goodness. Okay, it's back. Nah, there's some. T this is a totasm curse, dude. What the heck? The stream has. The stream is always laggy on totasm. I don't get it. It's the totasm curse. I swear to God. This finale slaps, though. I love this finale part. This final bit has some of the best gameplay in the entire tower, in my opinion, at least. Like it just uses the mechanics so well, and I love it. It's such a good send off. Like this is what a t floor ten should be. Just a good send off. Reusing most of the old mechanics and just like, having amazing gameplay. Like, this is what a floor 10 should be. I'll definitely. Yikes. The Totasm curse. Thank you, Nettity, for making this amazing tower. That was good. That was good. I like that a lot. Okay. Now, TOOV without safety nuts. If I remember correctly, and I probably do, the button is right here. Yep. Let's go. Do you think I can first try this? Because I personally don't think I can, but it'd be funny if I did. Also, I love how this tower's old name was Tower of the Little Drippy. Like, <laughs> it's so- What am I so mad? It's so goofy, but it's so stupid, and I love it. No! Oh my god. No! Oh my god, stop screwing me over! Oh no! They removed the thing! There used to be a thing that says a thing here. Why did they remove it? Okay, this is pretty much where uh, I cannot, can no longer fall. I literally can no longer fall from this point onward. Failing leads to death. Failure is inevitable, though, and failure will happen, and that's okay. You can't expect to do everything first try after all. I don't find TOE consistent at all, honestly. I take Yellow Path. I also take Yellow Path, and I find TOAE very consistent. Well, you're doing one thing right. You're not picking the Blue Path. Because I'll be honest, if you're picking the Blue Path, please don't grind to Astral Eclipse. You're not gonna enjoy it. Let's go do something else. Like, Astral Eclipse ain't, ain't, ain't it, it, it's just not fun on the blue path. I'm gonna be honest with ya. Okay, I, I have the perfect music for this. I've already, I've already, I've already like, picked this song late, or earlier in the stream. But let's do it again, because it, it, this does feel like a final stretch, so might as well, you know? Okay, let's go. This is the finale. This is for all the marbles. That was so anticlimactic, holy. I should get back pretty quickly because I have a lot of button progress, so it's okay. It's not like I lost my whole run, I literally saved the run by falling on the ledge. It still was anticlimactic as heck. Okay, look, see, there's button progress. It's okay, the run isn't over until I say it's over. The run ends when I say it ends. Okay, 
That was a close one. Holy, holy guacamole. Yep, it was a save. Yikes. Oh, that sucks a lot. But it's okay. The stream hasn't lagged since Totasm. I'm telling you, it's the Totasm curse. The Totasm curse is the thing that made the stream lag. It's always the Totasm curse. If anything wrong, if anything bad happens to you in real life, it's just say it's Totasm's fault. It's just say it's the Totasm curse's fault. Just say Totasm cursed you. It's the Totasm curse. Trust me, everyone will believe you. If you commit a crime, it's just say it's the Totasm curse. I had to. Blame Totasm for everything and anything you possibly can. It's always Totasm. Remember that and go by that philosophy. Killed innocent children. Yes, it's the Totasm curse. It's not me, it's the Totasm curse. Always blame Totasm. Well, if you're on the please wanted list, it's Totasm's fault. It's always Totasm. You gotta go by that philosophy. <laughs> because it's... It's totally not a flawed philosophy. That makes absolutely no sense. It makes so much sense. I mean... Why would you not blame a, a tower that literally hasn't affected you in any way in the real world, you know? Like, think smart, not hard. Obvious. Once we get a, 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 an SA teaser, then SA is coming out soon, like Zone 8. Yeah, but I, I, I'm i pretty sure... I, I wouldn't be surprised if they just don't announce the SA release date. It'd be way more fun. I hope they do what they did with Lost River, where they just and release it silently. Because I loved it where Lost River just released silently, no prior teasers or setups. I don't know why, but I really love that. It's just so fun. Just figuring out what the big dub update is when the thing was cancelled. The Christmas event or whatever. Just so sick. Because I didn't- I, I was like, oh, it's probably gonna be a sub realm. I didn't think- I didn't, like, expect- what several it would have been I like lost river that would have been the last thing I expected I for like I don't know it just came out of nowhere especially since there was no contest and we were used to contests so you know it kind of like worded me out because I fully did not expect it but it was so fun because like that element of surprise you know so enjoyable it was a really fun release. Would have been cool if I just. It would have been cool if I streamed it. Back then I wasn't streaming, so it doesn't matter. I do like streaming. Honestly, streaming has made JSO to me like a lot more enjoyable. Like not even. I'm not even joking. Streaming it genuinely just made JSO more enjoyable, and it made me meet up with more like more people that I wouldn't wouldn't have ever seen in the community. It's just sick. Like streaming streaming is unironically just really fun. It brought back the joy of Jato that I just haven't felt in so long. It's time to do this. Whew. Come on, we can do this. This is it. For all the marbles. Oh, is that it? Yes! GG! We did it! Let's go! Oh, gotta get out of here. Oh, that's two out of four now. GG! Oh, what's next? Oh, this is a fun one. This is a fun one! Just saying, I did all of the psychological and safe. I'm gonna be doing all of the psychological and safe towers for like these challenges, which is kind of cool. Yeah, the theme is the punishment, which I really like. Okay, this is the button that I need to press. Good luck, man. Thank you. Why don't you do the wheel packs anymore? Is it because it gives you the worst ones? No, uh, it's because I kind of like doing stuff in difficulty order a bit more. Like, for example, I enjoyed Zone 8 because I did, did everything in difficulty order. Because how I see it is I do the beginner challenges, and they warm me up for the intermediate ones. I do the intermediate ones, they warm me up for the advanced ones. And basically, it goes like that, and I like that a lot. I don't know why, but I like that. 
Yikes. Just a lot more fun that way, to me at least. Also, T1R, T1R perfect run isn't even the perfect run because there are a few things you can fail without getting killed. For example, this. You can fail this without getting killed. I also really liked Koak. I somehow enjoyed it. I personally did not enjoy Koak too much, but I can see the appeal of it. T1R is overrated. No one can change mine. I mean, I'm not gonna try to change your mind because at the end of the day, everyone has different opinions and that's fully fine. Like, you can't have everyone agree with the same exact opinion. That's... Not only is that a silly idea, it's fully impossible. And plus, if everyone's gonna have the same exact opinion, then there's not gonna be any diversity, you know? What's the point of, like... How are you gonna be unique if you just think the same as everyone else, you know? You have to have different opinions for the world to function. Start from the bottom, now we're... <gasps> Okay! I beat S1C on mobile, congrats. Hopefully you enjoyed the grind. This part sucks a lot. What I do is I go from the top. I go from the top. Oh, I messed that up. I messed that up. It didn't bounce me. It, it normally bounces me. Yeah, but that bun trust just sucks. It literally doesn't work for me. Never ever. I love monthly streams. Yeah, that's one of one of the reasons why I loved watching like Punky's streams when she was still not a bad, not exposed as a bad person. I loved them because I just loved watching people do monthly challenges. It was fun. And when Punky they got exposed, I feel like a hole was left in the community, like a hole, like not a hole, but like a hole in the content. There wasn't really anyone doing monthly challenge streams, you know. So I decided ah, I'm, I, I do monthly challenges all, every month, might as well do them. And I did them, because they're kind of fun. And I like monthly challenges a lot. They're really fun. Nice. What? I think we can agree that that wasn't my fault. Okay, back here. Let's go. Bada beat the thing. Yes! Okay, there's one more slightly RNG part. There's only one more. This, this part. Oh, I didn't... I'll take it, I'll take it, I'll take it. I don't mind, I don't mind, I'll take that. I got it, I- Nope, never mind, yep, yep, never mind, never mind. Oh, uh, I was thinking about doing TOTB as my third extreme, well, good luck with that, because TOTB, TOTB kinda bad, I'm not gonna lie, TOTB sucks. It's not a fun tower to grind, at least it wasn't for me. Let me maybe you'll enjoy it. Eagle, are your eyes okay? I don't know, they feel fine. Do you guys remember when TOSM was RAM? I do. Well, I don't. I just heard, I've, I've just heard stories about it. So funny how it was Ram. Same with Toso. Like, how did they butcher the difficulties so hard? It, it just... I don't know. Like, it's just so stupid. Like, difficulties were just so misunderstood back then, it's funny to me. What is TNR the perfect run? TNR the perfect run is basically Tower of No Return, and you can't, but you can't fail at all. There's no safety nets. Yeah, Toso as well, as I said earlier. It's those two towers mainly that basically were REM and then got changed to extreme. Both Toso and TOSO, oh, that was close. Both of those towers. And it's so funny, like, oh my goodness. Yeah, and if nerf Toso is extreme, then what was unnerf Toso? I wanna know. Yeah, if you fall, you have to restart your run. Doesn't matter where you fall, you just have to restart your run. Like, for example, if I fail now, I have to restart my run. That's how this works. That's what the perfect run is. Oh, crud. Nice. Okay, I need to just... Okay, nice. Didn't fail it. Yes! Monthly challenge done. Let's go. Yeah, the third. This is the first basement. I f I'm pretty sure this counts as the first basement. Let me just see. Let me make sure.
Yep, it counts. GG! That's three out of four, only one left. Now, if you don't mind, I'm gonna continue this run. Let's see how far I can get. Also, also, you can fail this. This isn't a perfect run, you can literally fall here. See? Like, it's so funny to me. Perfect run. Ain't, ain't, this ain't no perfect run if you can fail that. Okay, this either way this kills you, so it doesn't matter. This is pretty much the same as the old floor 6. No difference, really. Okay, well now this is where the things are now, like, different. Because I can't fail this. Sucks. Change the current challenge to be TONR the perfect run. <laughs> sure. Okay, this outside shouldn't be too bad. I can s it's failable, but it's not too bad. Like, compared to the last outsides, it's pretty s straightforward and simple. Oh, that... Wow, that didn't bounce me. <laughs> well, that's the thing done, I guess. Well, there's only one left. Look, oh, look at what you've done now to me. Yep, this is gonna be fun. As I said, I've only played Floor 1 and I didn't like Floor 1, so hopefully it gets a lot better later on. Go outside for- you've been Oh yeah, I haven't streamed for 6 hours. Yes, I agree with the person who told Video Eagle to go outside. He should. I mean, playing things for 7 hours straight isn't good. Because that means I have to edit things for at least twice the amount of time. But let's ignore that. My god, at least I have only one hour left to edit, right? Please, just let me go home. Wait, do I even have a house? It is said that people have seven minutes of brain activity left after death. Oh, is that why you, you had to beat the thing in seven minutes for the secret- for like the hint for the secret ending? Of T-O-U-T-S-C or something? Because I saw that in 60mm's video or something. I guess I'm dead, guys. This is the Death Eagle death announcement. According to the, the Mind Electric, I'm dead. Oh wait, there's a safety net after Floor Free. Wait, what the heck? My memory is hazy. Yo, new subscriber! Thank you, Praise the Sun, for subscribing! I will now praise the sun because you subscribed. Thank you so much! I appreciate it, genuinely. Thank you. I'm tired. Well, that's not good. I skipped it! I'm evil! Is this act 2 now? Xmas? Yo, it's Christmas! It's Christmas! Yay, it's Christmas! Merry Christmas, everyone! Merry Christmas! Ho, ho, ho! Merry Christmas to all! I wish you- I wish everyone a Merry Christmas! And a happy new year. Oh yeah, Primus is a thing, I fully forgot. There's gonna be Santa Eagle. That's gonna be like probably the next Eagle lore edition. Oh my goodness, that's stupid. Oh, uh, why? I guess I needed to climb down. That's my fault, to be fair. That is my fault. This is really fun though. I kind of I'm, I'm I'm liking this tower honestly. Surprisingly, I was people I was expecting this to be garbage. This is kind of fun. Yeah, this is surprisingly way more fun than I expected it to be honestly. That's why I don't compliment a tower when playing it. Oh, that's a cool skip I found. Let's go. Let's go. Oh no, it's hell. No, wait. Oh, I don't have a light beacon. I could help him! Oh, if I had a light beacon. Not light beacon, light beam. No! Oh, that's such a waste! Especially since this lore probably requires you to have a, like a crystal. Okay, I have to be careful not to die. Oh, it sucks that I wasted the crystal. Floor 10 is apparently free. Well, that's good. Oh my goodness gracious! Ah, uh, yes, I love- I love near-death experiences. That's like the second- no, that's like the third one I've had today. I love almost dying. Okay, and I understand how that works now. Thanks for the help. Never mind! Yikes. 
kind of fell. Are you okay? No, I'm not. I've been doing monthly challenges for the past seven hours. You think I'm okay? I'm not okay. I was <laughs> never okay. Anyways, I'm going inside. Eagle, are you gonna be ninja that streams for like 12 hours? No, I'm almost done with this tower, and once I'm done with this tower, I'm gonna leave. Finally, I can take a break. I've been streaming for so long, I'm going insane! I'm going insane! But it's still pretty fun. I would have literally, like, not enjoyed it as much if uh, I wasn't streaming. So I'm happy I'm streaming. Like, streaming genuinely makes Jato just so much enjoyable. I'm, I wish I was joking, but it really does. Is that a wormy worm? That's a wormy. That's a wormer. Uh, I don't care. Dementia moment in it. What? Huh? It's a beef block? What? That's... Okay, I don't like that design choice. And they should have probably indicated that better. Like, at least added a question, uh, an exclamation point. I was too distracted by the wormy guy. This is the run, boys. This is the run, boy. Oh, that actually hurts my throat. Oh, god damn it. Okay. Let's go. This is it. Never mind. I take it all back. Why did you do 1 9 and not your? Because Tower of 1 9 is so much better than Tower of your. I'm not talking about OSC. I'm talking about gameplay now. Yeah, that's fair enough. I can see t t Toy being your favorite tower. It's definitely good. I just personally don't enjoy the gameplay on the first half. It gets a lot better once you get past like the dropper section, but other than that, the beginning of t Toy kinda sucks, I'm not gonna lie. But Toy isn't bad, I like Toy. I respect it, it's like a different tower. It's different from the status quo, and I, I appreciate towers that are different from that, from the status quo. Uh, that first- yeah, that first jump is cat. <laughs> Like, this first jump is the hardest one. I don't know why it's so hard. It shouldn't be that hard, but it's hard as heck. Maybe because it's on the left side and I'm not really a left side type of player. When will you do a face reveal? As I said, I'm probably never gonna do a face reveal. Mainly because, like, I literally just don't want to. Like, even if I had, like, 10 million subs, I probably wouldn't do a face reveal. Like, if my face got revealed, it would be due to, with, from a face leak, but I personally wouldn't do a face reveal myself. Just because I just don't want to do one. Hopefully none of these songs are copyrighted. And you're telling me you've only thought about that now. You've spent like 40 minutes in this tower, and only now you're concerned about the music. Why do I even edit videos for you? You don't pay me, you don't do anything to me, you're just an annoyance to deal with. Not only do you make me suffer by putting me for the worst conditions when it comes to editing, you also don't even give me a single penny. Oh my god. Why do I edit for you again? I don't think I'll ever do TOC or TOCP personally. Mainly because I want to peek at Tower of Elongated Runs just for the funny trail. Yes! 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 GG! We did it! Oh, we did it. Let's go! I am glad to announce that I have fully completed let me quickly get this ready. Wait, okay, so I am glad to announce that I have fully completed the May Monthly Challenges! Let's go! That was fun. Uh, these challenges weren't too bad, honestly. I quite enjoyed them. There wasn't really anything that was bad. This is my ticket amount now, 2,316. So yeah, that was actually really fun. I actually enjoyed it. What was the worst? I don't know, I wouldn't say any of them were bad. All of these were really fun. So, thank you everyone for joining, this was really fun. I'm not gonna spend them. I love the field.